Okay. Well, the col at least we have the college up now, so we should be getting some college students in to work some of our jobs, which would be good. Do I have to, honest to God, hire foreign experts for this shit? I guess I'm gonna have to. I don't have time to raid around for this anymore. I have to hire the foreign experts, otherwise we risk the capital again. I didn't know the rebel threat was growing that fast. That's fucking ridiculous. Maybe the lawyers are still rebelling, or but I don't know why they would be. It doesn't make sense. We took care of their problem. Oh, we don't have enough high school teachers. Jesus fucking Christ. Where the fuck did the high school teachers go? You see, this is why I was saying earlier, I wish I could lock down jobs, because it's just so fucking annoying whenever these, pa these fucking bastards decide, oh, we're just going to uproot and leave without telling you. It's just ridiculous. Like, we need a lot of high school teachers to get even the basis of our population educated. The fact of the matter, that is the absolute fact of the matter. If we don't have that, we're screwed. It's really that fucking simple. The Association of Tropican Officers has written a letter of gratitude. Ah, uh, the military faction's angry at us. We're at, like, 100% happiness. How the fuck is the military at faction angry at us? That's bullshit. That doesn't even make sense. Whatever. I'm just gonna fucking go with it. Apparently, maybe we just don't have enough soldiers for them. They want us to have as many soldiers as possible, as do I. Yeah, we're gaining rebels, like, every year for some reason. Luckily, we now are bringing in more soldiers. Like, as we gained that one rebel, we gained two soldiers. But we definitely need more than that. Which means we need to get this high school fucking working properly. Because if it's not gonna work properly, we're really fucking screwed. It's really that's fucking simple. I'm gonna set another guard station across the street. Because we need to have the largest fucking army in the world. I ain't letting the fuck- We ain't letting Macho Man's capital fall again. Let's fuck that shit. There we go. Set it right there. High priority construct. We will have the largest army on this planet. It's the last thing I fucking do. Because fuck these assholes. Fuck this island. And fuck the stupid people. The stupid fucking civilians that just decide to leave their fucking jobs repeatedly. Forcing me to go and bring in foreigners to do what should be their work. Okay, so we need to increase the garbage stream, and I forgot that was part of the things that we did earlier. So we need to actually set up a garbage thing, I guess, like over here. Make it a high priority construct. I'll go hire more guards, because I need to get as many military men as possible. And if my fucking civilians won't do it, I'm going to bring in outsiders to do it for them. I don't have time to wait around on these dicks. I'm summoning as many troops as I possibly fucking can. We will have one of the largest armies, so we're not letting this happen again. Our unemployment situation, well, we still got a few homeless. I think we can handle it, though, just by building another tenement. Should handle that situation. And we need to rebuild the... We need to rebuild these um, tobacco farms as well in order to get a cigar plant set up. So I'm going to go and build up the tobacco farms. Set both of those up. High priority construction. Environmentalists are pretty pissed at us, but as soon as we have this fucking 
thing is the waste disposal facility set up. I don't think they're going to be too angry anymore. I think we'll be able to handle most of their anger at that point. Hopefully. I and mean, that's my hope, at least. We're still getting more and more fucking rebels, but I think we should be about to get a new influx of soldiers coming in once the, um, the immigrants arrive. Can we actually afford another um, guard depot? We can't. We need another general to do that. Well, I'm going to buy us a military base so that they can all live on it happily together. So that's a high priority construction as well. Here comes the boat that should be carrying in all of our soldiers into the island. Our soldier shipment should be arriving now. Yeah, so we should have full garrisons. Most blessed president. Yeah, we have full garrisons. We need to set up that cathedral. So now that we have a full garrison, we should be able to hold the line relatively well against the rebels, I'm hoping. Is there a way to actually see the number of rebels on the island? Is that a thing that we can possibly do? Uh, is, 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 is it listed as a faction? There is, okay, here it is. There are six rebels on the island. We have 11 soldiers. So we should be fine, so long as we keep building up the military. We now outnumber them, at least. But I'm not going to take leave anything to chance, of course. I'm going to... Hopefully, I don't need to hire any more. Because we'll just have enough I college have students. News, sir. The rebels are afraid of yeah, they better be fucking afraid. Screw those assholes. Those fucking dicks think they can do whatever they want. Great. Has seized me as I watch how the risk Listen, I think they can have the elections and deal with it. It's like 57 happiness down there. We're, we're fine. We can handle it. We just need to keep the rebels at bay. And if we can keep the rebels at bay, we'll basically win. Hopefully. The llama wool is about to finally build up and loop over, which means good news for us. Oh the no, the rebels are launching an attack at the mine. And unfortunately, the mine they're probably attacking is too far away for us to respond. Yeah. That's the mine they're attacking. It's way too fucking far away for us to respond. Because our army was just not going to make it there in time. It's really that simple. It's too far out. They're going to have... Well, I don't know. They could drive. But no, it looks like they're going to run all the way over there instead. The hell were they doing? They just turned, like, the stormtroopers for a second there. Very odd. Look at these bastards go. I'm sure the people in these farms over here, are, they're just like confused off their ass. They just see a whole bunch of Tropican soldiers sprinting across the fucking island. It's like, shouldn't they be driving cars or something? We're getting even more rebels. Jesus Christ. Where are the rebels coming from? What are they... What's happening? Why are the rebels even appearing at this point? I mean, we outnumbered them by, like, 20. But that that's beyond the point. They just shouldn't be appearing at all, period. I'm gonna build another guard station, because fuck this. These re If these rebels want to go, they're gonna fucking get it. They're fucking getting it. Full, hardcore, getting it. Yes, we managed to win. Sweet. So the, our soldiers have reigned victorious over the land. They've won the game. They won the war, for, at least for the moment. And um, that's always good news for us. I could build more statues. I don't know if I want to right now, though. I mean, I'm pretty sure we built enough statues on the last island. I don't think we need that many more. Ten tourists have arrived in the island, which I suppose is good news. Elections without speeches. The They're about to, this is about the time that they launched that attack on our capital last time. I don't think they're going to be able to do it again. Not after the, what we've done to their army. I think we've actually decimated them. Yeah, we decimated those bastards. There's only six of them left. We've got like 16 soldiers, too. I doubt they'll be able to stop us. 
I think that's pretty much GG for the Rebels. Especially once we get this another fucking guard See? tower up, then they're really fucking screwed. The cathedral is about to come up. We'll just stand into the building and disarm the bombs and stuff. And then we'll. Don't worry, the rebels aren't gonna be around for much longer, so we won't have to deal with this shit. Also, why are we losing religious support? Do not fucking tell me that they. Yeah, they're okay, they're good, they're still there. I was about to say, if they fucking left their jobs again, I was about to fucking rage hard. Presidente, I know you are serious about your intention of welcoming every wretched soul. Okay, so we need to have shopping malls. We're back at that point, which means we need to get a power plant, and we're probably going to set it up, like, right there. Get our power coming in as quickly as possible. It's high priority construction. Once the cathedral's up, that sh this thing should be our next priority. Cathedral looks like it's about to go up, though, which is good news for us. up sweet so we should be getting some of our college if we ever get college students there's only fucking two of them in the entire country apparently Comrade Presidente, an article okay I'm fixing the housing situation you can stop worrying about it look I got tenements coming up left and right soon enough it won't be an issue Communist and environmentalist. Well, I don't think the, we can really help the environmentalists. We already we can't really do anything about them. their demands. Would basically require us to have no industry, and that's simply not going to happen. So we have to kind of just hold off. Pretty no, made in tropical. Our brand will prevail. It must. It is our only option. It is the only thing. It is a true symbol of tropic and glory. Pure affection should be not enough. There is no need for fraud. The pure affection of El Prez is all this country needs. So we're doing pretty well, happiness-wise. Que necesita? Muy buena. Okay. Congratulations, President you have won All right. Well, we managed to win the election, and we are bringing up the religious happiness pretty high. All we got to do now is get those shopping malls up. But I'm probably gonna leave it there, guys. Anyhow, I've been uh oh. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.